Olo. Today, I am Blackish Fan of White, also known as Scarred by Illusion. Embrace the Strange. Today's video is a review of my 8x8 canvas paper pad. I started it on November 22nd and finished it on November 29th. Although my goal wasn't to finish this pad faster than my previous 9x12 video, which you might know as the 20 paintings I did in 9 days. Well, with this pad, I was able to complete them faster because they were smaller pieces and I was motivated, to say the least, about bringing each idea to life. And I have built up quite a reservoir of concept sketches, so fear not, no skimping on artistic growth, challenging myself, and ultimately expanding my horizons has occurred. Buckle up and twist your mind. <laughs> I started off very strong with Lost and Found. It's the most dynamic of this bunch. And... With time, which has grown on me, so I don't find it as underwhelming as I did initially. A similar thing happened with Fortune Zero Flow. I really love this one now. Well, you can. The start of another sub-series I've yet to name. Speaking of, it's Sibling, Pentacle Sorrow, then something very different. Dreams Take Flight, or How Dreams Take Flight. I can't really decide. There's an undeniable Scooby-Doo vibe to it, but also a very strong underlying panic and distress. Just my take. The oddity continues with Upon the Horizon, in which I see a glimmer of Friedrich Nuch, Libra, and the bridge. Falling for the feeling. Timeless. Very personal. Love it. The Breaking Ache. The return to a subseries centered on this tortured figure. Mercy and Defeat. I think it's the cleanest and best well-rendered one of them all. So flawless. Just flawless. Compass and Flesh. A little dark. Then, both my pride and my shame. Nest. Very different. So interesting. Yet so poorly executed. Crashing Grace. My Redemption. Pierre. Heavenward. A little dark. A little light. Clear sibling of Pentacle Sorrow and While You Can. They were going through something. I don't know what for sure, but a lot is always happening with them. Portal 2 and Grow. Unrealized. Very unrealized. I have mixed feelings about it still, but we let it live. <laughs> I feel much better about Grip of Might. Mind to Keep. Wayfaring Labor. Ignore that I mislabeled it after the song that I mentioned in that video where I talked about it and... The attraction, in the moment, now and forever. Lastly, breakdown of Frey, which is perhaps my favorite of them all, or maybe Fortune Flow Zero, although they are almost complete opposites. The runners up would be Mercy and Defeat or Grip of Might, then possibly Lost and Found. So those were five, those are my top five maybe. Um, who were your favorites? What illusions stood out the most to you? Why do you think that? Comment something, anything, scathing even, would really be appreciated. There's a video on each one of these paintings, so if you want to watch their time lapses, it's only a click away. Well, a click or two away. Thanks for watching, and if you take anything away from this video, it is art, truly art, and art goes on, so I will in my next video.